Snowflakes and welcome to this video. I am so excited about this video because it is my first ever fitness video. So in this video I am going to tell you my goals I have set in place for the new year. I'm super excited about them. Then I'm going to show you some of my workout clothes which have inspired me a lot. And then lastly I'm going to show you three fitness DIYs. So let's get started. So the goals that I have set in place for 2016 is I want to become more healthier and I want to become fit and my goal is to do this before summer. So my goals are to work out three times a week. I am going to be doing yoga one day, cardio another day, and then the other day I'm just going to do walking and things like that like in the gym because we have a gym down at our apartment office and so I'm gonna go down there I have already started doing this for the past two weeks and it is awesome and the other goal that I have is I'm going to eat healthier I'm not going to be counting calories or anything for eating healthier I am going to be doing the Weight Watchers plan which I've already done last year and lost 10 pounds on it but um this is more for me being healthier rather than I'm obese or something because I'm not like a lot overweight or anything like I'm a few pounds overweight but the whole entire plan that I have is just to get more healthier I want to have more healthier habits and that comes from eating healthier and getting in the mood of exercising into the routine of that and that's what I'm planning on doing so one thing that's helped me a lot is keeping an exercise journal this is the journal that I have I was given it by my friend a long time ago but what I do is I just write down every day that I work out which is three times a week how I'm feeling and what kind of working out I did and then sometimes I'll even write down what I ate but it helps a lot because on those mornings when I wake up and I just don't want to work out at all looking at this journal really helps me and really wants me to work out so those are just basically my goals it's super simple super easy I for me I just want to get more healthier and more fit by summer so for my YouTube goals for this whole fitnessy thing is I am going to post a fitness video monthly so once a month I'm going to have a fitness video so this is a fitness video for January and then next month I have another video all the way through December and this is going to help me stay on track with getting more fit and stuff so my plan is to get more fit before summer but I want to keep having these healthy habits so I'm gonna do fitness videos all the way until December time so I'm super excited about it so my fitness videos will come out at the end of each month and if the end of each month falls on a Friday I will more than likely have DIY fitness stuff so look forward to that I've had a lot of requests to do fitness videos and this is perfect for me because I want to get more fit and more healthy so now I'm going to show you some of my exercise clothes so I showed you guys this fitness sports bra and I love it so much because it's just it has like this material back here that's like sweat proof I did get this at Walmart so I really love this a lot my other sports bra is this one I have this one and it, it's reversible so I can wear it two different ways and I also have two more of these one is red and one is black so I have a fitness outfit that I got and it's just these pants these are kind of like they're bigger than leggings are they're just kind of pants like dance pants and then I have this shirt that goes with it and I have not used these yet but um I maybe use them sometime but I really like leggings for working out and shirts that are really kind of cool so these might not be the best ideas for working out but I just have them in my workout clothes the two shirts I picked up I picked up this one from Walmart and this is for like summertime working out and it has this back to it I really really like this one a lot because it's like really easy to move around and I just love I got it on clearance for five dollars at Walmart crazy and my favorite workout shirt of all which I'm I just wear all the time is this one it's semi fitted it's by dance skin I got it at Walmart I think it was like eight eight to ten bucks or something there was one on clearance for like five bucks and I tried to have them switch it but they wouldn't do it so I had to pay more for this one but I love the material of it and the back also has like that sweat proof like meshy type stuff and this is so cool when you're working out it's awesome three fitness DIYs I'm going to show you how to make is first of all I'm going to show you how to make this exercise fitness jar it is so awesome and you could just pull out 
the exercises and then do them and it's super awesome see and you just pull them out there and then when you're done you can just you know set them here and I love this thing and I have been using this thing a lot so for this exercise jar you're just going to need some popsicle sticks you can buy them in colored but I just decided to paint mine and then you're going to think up exercises that you want to do and write them on the popsicle sticks and stick them into a jar and you can decorate your jar any way you want to but I just threw a ribbon on mine. If you're having trouble figuring out what kind of exercises you want to do, you can also go online and find lists of all kinds of exercises. Time you work out, you can just pull a few sticks out and you never do the same exercise twice. So the next thing I'm going to show you guys how to make is this water bottle timer. And so this water bottle has specific times on it. I don't know if you can see real well, but specific times on it when you should be drinking your water through the day. And this will help you drink your water and get it down you way faster and on time. So for this timer water bottle, you just need a permanent marker and you're just going to write times that you want to drink your water throughout your day onto your bottled water. And you might need to do this a few times just to make sure that the ink shows up on the water bottle. And that's it. And now you have a timer water bottle. The next thing I would teach you how to make is this bottle of bath salts. And this is awesome because anytime you work out, you're always super, like super sore. I'm always super sore after working out. But if I take a bath and I use bath salts, then I'm not as sore. So that's a tip for you guys if you're ever sore, use bath salts. The type of bath salts I use actually come from the dollar store. And they're these right here. They're bath salts. Yeah, bath soak and their lavender scent. They come in three different scents, but the lavender one definitely smells the best. So I went down and I sold the dollar store out of these and I put them in this awesome bottle just to sit by my tub and they smell amazing. After I work out, I always take a bath and so I put some of these in my bath. So these water bottles I did get at the dollar store, by the way. So I am just going to take one of the water bottles and just fill it with my bath soap or bath salts and just set it by my bath and any time I exercise I'm going to take a bath and use my bath salts. Super simple and easy. enjoyed this video please like this video if you really liked it and you want more fitness videos please leave your fitness video requests down below and I will try to fit them in to my fitness videos because these are gonna be a little bit of longer videos because they are fitness videos and they are once a month so please leave any requests that you have down below I could do fitness routines I could do fitness hairstyles anything that you guys want I would do it please let me know. Also, I'll have the hashtag, my fitness hashtag, right up here so you guys can follow me on Twitter and we could just share inspirational quotes, we could take pictures and share them and just kind of tweet this fitness journey that we're doing together. So I will see you guys in my next video soon. Bye!